We've got Miles Kristen on the line, and uh, Miles coming to us from Wisconsin. I got to ask Miles about the state of the election campaign down there. Uh, hello, Miles. Uh, good morning. I just woke up a few minutes ago, and I go outside my back door, and I look up into the dark sky, and I just just watched what uh, clearly looked like um, unexplained aircraft <laughs> okay. in the night sky. All right. So that was interesting. What are we talking um, here? Election. Are we talking huh? Black Hawk uh, helicopters, or are we talking oh, no, aliens? No, 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 no just uh, <laughs> very slow-moving white lights in the sky that, uh, that was uh, that was an interesting thing I just saw. Well, not the first time I've seen something like that, but uh, but this uh, election, oh god, where to start? It's like um, I would say that in many ways the Democrats are recreating 2016. You've got this vice presidential candidate Tim Waltz, who's much like Tim Kaine, except uh, Gwen Waltz is kind of even creepier than Jill Biden. Um, You've got this very unpopular woman who is somehow alienated both the left and right. I mean, you're, you're pro Gaza people, you know, they, they, they don't like her. They're not kind of supporter. I mean, even just moderate people on the left really are like, ew, you know, like they know Kamala's a liar. They know she's full of crap. Um, she is campaigning. I got to give her that. She is campaigning. That's one thing Hillary didn't do. But uh, she's clearly not doing interviews. And, I mean, Hillary did a lot of interviews. That's maybe not that many, but she certainly did more than this candidate's doing. They they got, they got did this whole thing without a primary, just like in 2016. They're doing the whole, like, hey, this is your candidate, like it or not. And, um, you know, props on C- uh, CBS for finally doing a real interview and asking actual questions. Uh, granted, they edited it afterwards. <laughs> Big time. Yeah, they condensed it. They made her look a lot. They made her sound a lot better than than she should have been able to. But you've got Obama as well. Obama's out there saying, "Look, he he understands. He knows. He's trying to stump for for Kamala." He says, "Black men just don't like her at all." I mean, let's listen a little bit to Obama here. Is that um, we have not yet seen the same kinds of energy and turnout in all quarters of our neighborhoods and communities as we saw when I was running. Now, I also want to say that that seems to be more pronounced with the brothers. Okay, so according to Obama, the the brothers are just not that crazy about Kamala. (laughs) I mean... I don't know anybody who's particularly it, crazy Barack, about her. Barack Obama stumping, Obama stumping for candidates hasn't done anything. You can look at all sorts of Senate candidates and gubernatorial candidates and so forth that he has tried to help get elected over the last, you know, eight plus years, and it actually hasn't done anything for these candidates. And um, I'm, I'm actually not. I think I don't think I'm going to vote in the presidential election. Oh. But you look at the coalition that Trump has organized, and it's like RFK and Tulsi Gabbard and lots and lots Elon of people Musk. that are from the left. Yeah. And lots of people are from the left. Um, and then you look at the coalition forming on the right, and it's like Dick Cheney and his daughter <laughs> and all sorts of Republicans. It's like, so the neocons have clearly gone Democrat, and uh, the 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 Trump train is full of uh, lots of people of different ideologies. Yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> Thank you, Miles. I really appreciate you calling in. Let's get you to no give problem. us an update uh, next week, all right? All right. Yeah, and uh, we'll do. And uh, if people have a chance, check out Wisconsin International Radio. I'm uploading a lot of stuff to uh, the YouTube channel, WI Radio and Wisconsin International How Radio. How do people There's find that? Channel, so. Okay, where do they find uh, that? Just just look up, uh, if you go on YouTube, go at Wisconsin Radio or WI Radio or Wisconsin International Radio, and you'll find all the channels. Thank you, Miles. Appreciate that.